Good evening, Brian. It's Friday. So as you know, this has been kind of a busy, uh, impactful second half of the week. Um, as you know, Mom had her procedure a couple days ago and then was in the hospital overnight. So I didn't actually record a vlog Wednesday. There was just too much going on. So I apologize for that. Okay, so I'll post this vlog. Hopefully I'll post another one. Hopefully a Thursday top five, even though it's not on Thursday. And then I'll post another one and then we'll be all set for you to start on Monday and back on the swing of things. I think given the circumstances, it is an understandable diversion. So as you can probably see from right over here, um, today's vlog is a little bit different, Brian. Um, so I want to talk a little bit about creativity. Um, it's something that I want to do more of. I know that you have been really into artwork, both drawing and photography more and more lately, and you've been really getting pretty good at that and, and exploring that more and more, and that's really awesome. And you know, I uh, have always wanted to do some kind of visual art, like drawing. I've always wanted to be able to draw something and have that kind of way to express things, but I've never gotten good at it. I probably just need to practice and sit down and do it, but I've never been really strong in visual arts. Um, and while I wouldn't necessarily call myself an artist or a musician, I have long liked playing music. And as you know, I left the guitar and the bass at home when I moved out three years ago and haven't really done much with it since then, except I got that new guitar um, about a month and a half ago, two months ago, and I've really enjoyed getting back into it and have relearned some songs I used to know and learned some others that I didn't know before and have also messed around on some songs that are not by other artists, but are by either me or dad. In the case of this example, this is a tune that dad wrote, and I'm sort of experimenting and playing around with different variations on it as I repeat it this vlog. But uh, I just wanted to sort of get your uh, opinions on creativity and your feelings about creativity and what you usually do for that. Um, one exercise that's really stood out to me, and I think it's something that I might like to try to do, is the idea of setting up for yourself a daily challenge or a daily task related to something that you want to do more of. And this could be with something with anything else. It could be, you know, you could spend five minutes a day for a whole month meditating as a way to build that more as a habit or something like that or doing something or taking a picture once a day to see how you change over time but I've also seen a lot of them that are specifically geared towards creative output that are you know you have to spend you know at least five minutes a day no more if you don't have time for it sketching something so every day you have a quick doodle the whole point is not to produce something that is masterpiece worthy or something that you would hang up on the wall the whole point is to just get you doing it. And sometimes the biggest obstacle obstacle to doing things like that is just getting yourself started. And so there are things where it's like, you know, um, draw one thing a day for a month, or there's lots of challenges like that. There's specific names for them that relate to the hashtags people use when they share them, and I can't think of any right now. But things like that that are really neat, where, you know, every day you make a doodle or a sketch or something. And then over the course of that month, not only do you get more used to doing it and more comfortable doing it, but you also start to get a little bit better. Uh, I've also, there's Jonathan Mann, who is a guy who has written a song a day, I think, for years now, where every day he writes a song. It's not usually a very great song necessarily, but the whole point is to just get the exercise of writing a song, get that process being ingrained in his head. Um, and those things are really interesting, and I've got a plethora of extra field notes books, and so I'm always tempted to do something like that where I tell myself that, you know, at least once a day I'm gonna doodle something quick, to make a quick drawing. And I think that would be really helpful in sort of getting me out of my creative shell, as it were, and helpful in um, exercising those muscles and getting myself more used to it. So what do you think of things like this, Brian? Have you ever done something like that? Do you have any specific things that you do for creativity? Um, what do you think of the idea of a doodle a day or a drawing a day? Maybe that's something we could do together. Um, I'd love to know what you think about it. And I also look forward to hearing your thoughts on this video and whatever else you want to say in your Thursday Top 5, which might be later tonight or tomorrow on Saturday. But have a good night, Brian.